What is up, YouTube? This is Nemo again. Uh, back with another video of a game that I really love to play. It is called Knights and Dragons. It is a RPG game. Pretty much, you'll battle your way through uh, the map area here, unlocking new territories. Each different water elements, earth elements, fire elements, spirit elements, uh, stuff like that. You work your way down here to this area here. You'll beat the Dark Prince and the game's pretty much over. But you can go back and farm maps again. Like I like to ha like to farm the Haunted Cathedral on Epic because it gives you more XP points and you can rank up. And keep leveling up. The highest you can go, well, you can max you max that at a hundred, but you can get like level. There's a deal here. It's got like level two thousand. Once you max out at a hundred on your health and your attack, you will continue to get rewards like gold and keys and gems and stuff like that every time you level up. But other than that, uh, I am going to play because somebody told me about the new boss to come out called the Blood Mage. Uh, I want to fight her because the armor looks pretty cool. She's a fire element, so we're going to roll with... I'm going to play... I'm going to blast her down with the water element. I know it looks easy right now that I just killed her in one hit, but it's going to take you a while to get to where I'm at, trust me. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I don't think I got my first legendary armor till I was like level... F what was I? I want to say like level 30, 45, 50, somewhere around there. It takes you a while to build up the attack to actually defeat an epic boss. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to fight this low level real quick. Because I'll fight this and then I'll lock the boss again. Let's real quick. Excuse me for a minute, I'm going to turn my volume down, it's a little loud. Alright, we're going to fight her again. <laughs> you have to beat her 15 times and you get the craftable armor for a legendary. And if you spend lots of money like some people do on here, you can keep going. The highest I ever made it without buying any gems it was like 45, I think. Uh, you can you can get free gems by watching videos and stuff. You can get like as far as you can go, 60. You'll get like 10 keys, 10 dark, five dark prince keys, and five gems, which is really not worth it to keep going. To tell you the truth, it's just some random crap. I just like to get the craftable armors. Because you can fuse them together and get different armors. You're supposed to be able to fuse two le legendaries together and get like an epic armor. Which I fused a lot of legendaries together and never got an epic armor. Which kind of makes me mad. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I'll show you some more stuff here in a minute. I'm answering pretty, pretty for you. Oh, excuse me for a second. Okay, I'm back. Uh, well, like, after you beat 
I guess you'd call it the campaign mode where you gotta fight for other maps and stuff. Uh, you can join a guild. Uh, get into a good guild, people that are actually active. Because the more active people you have in your guild, the more chances you'll get to get better armors and rewards in the guild wars. Uh, they have a fusion guild war, which is only 24 hours. You fight to battle it out to see how many fusion boosts you can get. Then you got the regular guild wars. They go on for, I think, I want to say like six days they go on, five or six days. Like your your clan to battle it out for six days with other clans. You know, you get rewards. Top rank, number one, like the top ten people always get the best rewards. But the top guilds always cheat. They have hack tools out that people pay for and stuff like that. You get free gems and like free gold. And, it's, no, and don't, don't try to comment on my page, guys, and tell me all you get don't cheat. Because when y'all come in first every single time with only 30 members, y'all cheating. I'm sorry to tell you. Or you're spending lots of money, which is really kind of stupid to spend that much money on this game when you can get hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of free, free gems. But this game is a good game to pass time. I like to play it. I think I unlocked the boss. Nope, no, I didn't. I'm trying to think what else I can tell y'all about this game. Oh, uh, this game is pretty much never ending. I mean, besides beating the, the levels after that, you I mean you can go back and play it again to get XP and stuff. But, uh, this game pretty much never ends. Like, there's always a new boss coming out. There's always a new guild war. Like I said, there's fusion wars. There's guild war. There's, like, the orc war. They had some other war a couple weeks ago, but I forgot the name of it. Uh, it this is never ending. It just goes on and on. I ain't been on in a few weeks. I've been working a lot here lately. And I ain't had time to get on play the game. Now that I've got a day off, I figured I'd make a video and show you all this game. But right now, I'm going to shut up because I've talked enough and I'm going to finish trying to beat this boss.
Well, guys, I'm about to cut this video short because YouTube's been uh, uh, being retarded here lately and won't let me upload any videos past 15 minutes. So there's going to be a part two to this video. So you see me, I'll beat the, the beat the boss. Uh, so uh, leave me comments on my page, please. Uh, I really appreciate it, and I will uh, let me know what kind of videos you want me to like post and stuff. Give me some ideas for games. Uh, leave them in my comments, and I will either download them or buy them, and I will try to make some gameplay video for y'all. But I'm going to go ahead and go ahead. Uh, excuse me. I'm going to go ahead and jump off of here. Uh, hope y'all like the video.